West interview. Take one. Marker. There were two films I saw at an age that is a little younger than I think people commonly expect you to experience those films. And each of them made an enormous impact on me. The one that's probably the most tremendous, at age seven or eight, my dad called me into the living room and said, son, climb up here on the sofa. We're going to watch a movie. The movie came on. It's black and white. Uh, OK, dad, I'll sit through it. And the rest of the story is that movie was Citizen Kane. I've been involved with the Sarasota Film Festival since before its inception. I remember in the early days when we were discussing the need for there to be a Sarasota Film Festival. There's no question for me. M my favorite part of the film festival is something SRQ Magazine does every year. We set up a white studio psych on location at event after event, and celebrities come in one after another to have their picture taken and their portrait taken, and experiencing that brief interaction with interesting people that you normally only see on screen in really what is a very normal, real moment for them is always very exceptional for me. Our audience is future thinking. They're willing to reach out and see stories or experience points of view that maybe they don't agree with, that maybe they've never even heard of, and allow themselves to be affected by them. That's almost the definition of someone that is a risk taker. My favorite film festival memories tend to be seeing the real sides of a number of celebrities that we've gotten to enjoy having here and interact with. Uh, having uh, Michael Stipe give me advice on what sort of contact lenses I should switch to. Unusual, and I'll always remember it. Watching John Voight give out hugs left and right to every single little old lady that came up to him smiling and, um, and reaching for him. Friday the 13th or Nightmare on Elm Street? Oof. Nightmare on Elm Street, explicitly because of the meta stories within. <laughs> Listen to me, I have something to say. It's better to burn out than to fade away. Is that from Captain Ron? I don't even know what that is. <laughs> what movie is it? There can be only one. Highlander. It's the Kurgan. Oh, yeah, what is yeah, wrong yeah. with you people? When the Kurgan is leaving the, 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 the church. Uh, 